Hi, this is our 5.0 Escape Camper, a 2019. When you order these, you can get the, the doors with glass now, or I'm sure it's some kind of plastic. You can get a couple of different kinds of woods. You can order your countertop, any color you want, floor. I think that's an Amana is all of the lighting that my husband did and you see it's just on a tape is another good feature is a lightweight shelf in the oven space he installed a sliding drawer we went with a, um, a umbrella fabric i do have a little cover on it because we decided not to have the table and we did the wrap around bench to give us more seating because we use this as our couch. Our TV's over there and you can literally, you know, stretch out very nicely and sit here and watch the TV from this space without having the cumbersome getting around the table. The other thing that we added just to help us out are these little fold down um, trays. They'll put these anywhere you want it. So we just had one on each side for each of us. They can add additional lighting like this in the corners. We also have them installed at each of the heads of the bed so that we can turn them on. Uh, many people like to have that little additional table right here next to the sink. But I opted not to because I was concerned about um, bumping into it, getting out the door. The freezer is, can you, got it? Yeah, I got it. Yeah, you might want to look in the freezer because those are all vacuum packed and you can see oh my gosh, you are how so much you organized. can put in there. You are so organized. Did you make your meals ahead? Yes. Look at those. Oh, look at that. Oh, That's that. a lot of meat when you vacuum seal it. Do you use the microwave at all? Yes, we use the Can microwave it? a lot. It's it's just because we're here in Portsite. Can you yeah, so when you have when you're hooked up, you use yeah. This is heavy, but he likes to do this kind of thing so that it t it's it uses the total oh space. Gosh. Yeah, that's nice. Where I'm more like this kind of girl. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah. Pull it out, nice uh -huh. and soft. My pants are in one. My tops are in another. You know. And then even tinier little container. You know, you've got your, oh, your yeah. bras in one in and your socks all in another. Uh, oh, that. Rockets. Yeah, because I think they just have like a little plastic one mm -hmm. that comes with it. Mm -hmm. So that's another thing Escape will do. I don't know about now, but they they did then. If you purchased something and had it sent to their company, on a lot of things that they would um, install it. You can get these at uh, any RV places and your boat dealers sell these to put on your floor and i know a lot of guys have done all kinds of different little things with the vanity but he put one little metal bar these never come out the security on this is really really good so one bar a little aluminum bar does it um, another thing that we decided not to do is to not put in the little corner sink it's real small. You step out of the bathroom and you've got the larger sink. We installed this later, but they will install the larger sink at the factory. And to have this nice little feature of bringing your water closer to your, your object helps with overspray and for your cleaning. Prior to owning the Escape, we had a scamp camper and we loved it that was also a fifth wheel the dimensions between this and the scamper when we ordered the scamp and kept looking at the 5.0 fifth wheel in this 
in the written numbers, it doesn't look all that much. But the layout is a big difference. The headroom in the scamp, you have to peek out your windows. Um, there's a lot more space. You can pass each other here. Also in the scamp, about here is your stairway going up. So you have to go up the stairway. There is a queen size bed in the scamp, but it's cut out in a rounded form the front end of your camper. So it's not a full size queen bed and you are crosswise on the, t the bed. Whereas this one, you ease, you've got a scoot, but you don't wake each other up when you have to get up at night to go to the bathroom. This is just your basic curtain. It's insulated. And this is just a dowel. The little cups, you can get at any hardware store. Another great feature in the Escape fifth wheel these two first steps open up, but they come carpeted. My husband took off the carpeting and redid them with oak stair treads. So there's plenty of storage for your shoes. Other one you can put in this storage, but the top one was not cut. So he cut it and hinged it. It's a large opening that you'll be losing if you don't take advantage of it. This is where it stops. Instead of opening all the way, and then you've got to hook it back here, it stops right there, mm -hmm. which also makes it really easy when you're inside just to grab it and close it shut. It's got power jacks. And each jack, the switch is right there, each jack is individually operated. So you can level it individually on each side when you're not on an exact level spot. Our other fifth wheel, you had to have a screw thing to, to deal with that. Mm -hmm. And then... I opened that up. Well, the propane tanks, the double propane tanks. And then there's this storage here. So you can use this to wash dishes if you have a, a dish tub underneath, or you can plug in the shower. And then there's one small little outside storage area here. Now there's USB port, USB and 12 volt. There and there's an external, there's an external ZAMP port. Yeah, that's kind of a cool thing. I have that cross on there. There's a yellow line on this top. You see that yellow line right there? So all you do is when you back up, you turn around back up, you just get in line with that yellow line and back up till you hit the horizontal line, boom, you're right on, nice. right on top. Nice. Added a cargo carrier, removed the spare tire bracket and the spare tires now carried in the back of the pickup truck. I added an extra tube to hold your sewer slinky because there's always that place that you go to dump or campground where you need two lengths. So you ordered it with a high lift axle. Can't, yes, high, high lift axle came with a high lift axle. We ordered it with the solar. 190 watt oh. solar panel on the top. Thermal windows. So you bought it with that, those rims and tires? Those are the the original tires. I added a uh, bug screen there on, on the water heater and uh, also on the furnace to keep the mm -hmm. wasp mm -hmm. and hornets. And also he underneath the uh, mm -hmm. refrigerator vent. If you enjoyed this video, buy me a coffee. Every little bit helps to offset the cost of making these videos. If you'd like to see more videos like this one, hit the subscribe button.